Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Tech TV. Today we're talking about the mass airflow sensor. You might be asking yourself, what is that? I mean, if you already know, this video is for us to get in the know. So let's begin. In gasoline engines primarily, it is super important that the mixture of gasoline and air be very free of contaminants. For a gasoline fuel, the stoichiometric air fuel mixture is about 14.721, i.e. for every one gram of fuel, 14.7 grams of air are required. You might be saying, oh yeah, sees, that sounds real good in theory, but how the heck do I control that? Basically, what we have to do is measure how much air is going into the engine, and once we know that, we know how much fuel to inject to keep up the ratio. There's two ways to detect it. One is the on the inlet side through the mass airflow sensor, and the other is measuring on the outlet side if the mix is rich or poor. But let's focus on this. That is the sensor on the inlet side. We'll call this the MAF for short. And it works based on the principle of a hot wire or a hot film. Here's how it works. First, air enters the intake system. When the engine is running, fresh air enters the intake system through the air filter. Then, as the air pulses into the system, the MAF uses a heated wire or film that is positioned in the path of the incoming air. The MAF sensor utilizes the concept of the hot wire slash film principle, where the wire or film is heated to a specific temperature. As air flows over the wire or film, it cools it down. The MAF sensor measures the cooling effect on the wire or film caused by the airflow. The rate of cooling is directly proportional to the airflow, and through that is how we measure the 14.721. Why that ratio? Why 14.721? Well, this has been found to be the perfect-ish ratio there to be for the best balance of gain and loss. But since gas is not perfect, something always gets left over. And that is what the catalytic converter is there for, to pick up the slack of what got left over. But the catalytic converter cannot work properly either if things are not balanced from the start. The mass airflow sensor is the first piece of the system to reach that balance. Subscribe to our channel, Autotech TV. Technology, clear and simple.